science or technology, and yet they have trouble dealing with a deep voice lock. Are you kidding me? They seriously don't have backups of this sort of thing in case something goes wrong? Like, they don't have like a recorded message of what your voice recording message is. Or if you're really crafty like the Riddler, put in several pieces and then have them piece it together just, you know, to screw with them. I mean, it just sounds like, it just sounds lazy to me. I'm sorry, it just does. Uh, let's see here. Let's run a check, status check. Alright, so open one, two, hey, can we buy please? Oh, and we need a conduit. Damn it, okay. Let's open the blast door. To the fuel depot. Perfect. Oh, damn it. Almost burnt there. <sighs> Let me see. Oh, hi. Was that stupid droid of yours gonna come through or not? Hey, don't miss the droid, dude. He will kick your ass. Well, I'm beginning to think I was a little better off in my... Dumb bitch. We have a sword. Hey, what do you know? A little cargo cylinder came through. It is strange that way, but we know what happened, but let's be nice. If he got the turbo loops working, then we should have a clear run to the hangar. Wait, wait, don't tell me you're taking that hatch down into the mining tunnels. Are you? That explosion I heard came from below. There's probably nothing down there except superheated rock and collapsed blast tunnels. You'd be an idiot to go down there. It's a good thing I'm one hell of an idiot. I love all these references. I know there's a lot of sacrifice besides. So I was gonna save our skins. I love that. Uh, those of us who have seen the originals will know exactly what that's from. Exact scene from the exact moment. Because we love those movies and we are just nerds like that. But I'm gonna pick number one because well, I like the new guy. Yuri 
either really brave or really crazy, or both. All right, I'll try to monitor things from up here. Be careful. The only thing moving down there is likely to be mining droids, so don't be playing hero too hard. Uh, not that I care what happens to you or anything. I just don't want to be trying to get off this rock by myself. Trust me. You're repaying me very soon. I'll keep the comm link open. I may be able to guide you through the tunnels from up here. Don't know if the signal will hold if you get too deep, though. Yeah, the comm link. I'm actually kind of liking how they put this in this game. The comm link. Usually, usually that's only in, like, you know, in the movies, of course, with C3PO talking to Luke and such in the first movie. Let's see. Is there anything else really quick? Just, oh, right, energy shields. Pick those up with T3. I don't know how they got into my character's inventory from him, but whatever. I'm not going to question it. We have a society full of... Full, we have a game full of, like, um... I can't think right now. Uh, magic using, uh, lightsaber wielding, you know, badasses. I'm not going to question how stuff got transported. I could easily just say, the Force did it. Let's see here. Ooh, purple. It's like 20 or something like that. 15 to 20, that kind of angers me. I, it's gonna, Can you read me? It's gonna be worse in those freaking... Oh man, it's gonna be worse in those freaking tunnels because there's a lot of smoke. I'm gonna get my frame rate drop immensely. Oh my god. Grammar. I don't have it. I'm sorry. Anyway. Yeah, I thought you were crazy. We're telepathic for a second. What did you say? Your signal's crammed with static. There's a lot of interference down there. Probably caused by that explosion. Still, it looks like there's a route down to the Paragas fuel depot. If the passages haven't collapsed, that explosion knocked out most of the sensors. There should be an emergency crate in the next room. Watch yourself. There's a lot of droid broadcasts in that area, but I can't pin them down. Of course. But either way, I'll be careful. If you take anything, signal me. Will do. And be careful down there. I don't worry. I have my trusty sword in my red shoes. I see. About time. The whole half-naked Jedi thing was wearing a little thin. But there may be some survey gear in the safety harness inside the crate, too. The miners wear them when staking claims on the asteroids. The survey gear is designed to spot and protect you against sonic mines. And the safety harness can be helpful if you try to disarm them. Yeah, it's like a military-issue energy shield, except it's designed to protect the miners against lasers and heat. It should work against the droid mining lasers. It won't last forever, and certainly not against multiple laser hits. But it may buy you some time if you get ambushed by a battalion of droids. Oh, oh man, I'm sorry. Ow, my neck again. Sounds quite useful. Just equip it on your wrist, and then you can activate it like a med pack. Yeah. Again, it won't last forever, sorry. so make it Position count. myself to be a bit more comfortable. Uh, just one more thing. I've narrowed down some of the ID signals, and if the numbers are right, you're sharing those tunnels with a battalion of mining droids. Yeah, they'll never know what hit them. Well, these are construction models. They shoot like a moisture farmer militia. Since they rely on ranged weapons, get in close with a melee weapon and start bashing them. In close combat, the guy with the vibro blade has the edge over the guy with the rifle, droid or not. Otherwise, just drill them from a distance. If they're not shielded, that is. There's gotta be some central controller down there. See if you can find a terminal by the main access shaft. That'd be governing intelligence. Now, here's a point, actually. When he said the guy with the viral blade has an edge over the guy with the rifle when he's up close, that is actually very true. Because, honestly, it's just common fact of the whole, you know, I can hurt you now, and your weapon is almost useless at this, you know, close. Unless you happen to hit it with, with the rifle mode or something like that. Like this outfit, I'm actually going to dig it. I don't know what it is, maybe it's just the pouches. The pouches get to me, it's like right here. Very nice. Broken control, give me some. Yeah. Perhaps it's coming in a little bit.
Watch where you step. I'm picking up a lot of sonic mines down there. Don't run unless you have to. It makes them harder to spot. If you have any skill with demolitions, you might be able to recover them and use them against the droids. That is, if the mines don't get you first. If you have survey gear or a safety harness, put them on. They'll make spotting and disarming the sonic charges a little easier. Thank you. 